Hey, I'm Ross with Sky Management. Welcome back. Today I wanted to talk to you about some common problems that you have with vertical blinds and how to quickly and easily solve these issues. So let's jump right in. The first problem we have is if you have one of your slats that isn't turning with the rest of them. So I've closed them and this one is off. And then you try to close it the other way, it gets closed before the rest of them do. There's a little gear in the top here and it can get off a little bit. So all you have to do is grab a hold of that top one and click it over like that. That's This one was one click off. So now it should operate with the rest of them just fine. And that's the quick easy fix for one of those. The second problem I'd like to address is when you have a slat that just freely spins like this. Then when you try to open and close the blinds, this one just over here doing nothing. It's just spinning around. Well, that's because the gear in the top that spins this is missing a piece. There's this little tiny gear that goes up in there that tells this slot to spin. So as you can see on this side, there are these little holes and there are little gear grooves on the top. So the gear grooves on the top go against that aluminum rod that's in the middle there. And I'm gonna pull this out so that you can see it. So you take the little car that just spins freely and we're gonna pull this bottom piece out to the side and it'll go toward this, the swivel stick side. So I'm gonna pull out this little piece and there's little gears on it on the top. So that piece goes in there like that and you'll see this nub that sticks out right here. That's gonna go away from the opening in the car. So uh, this will go toward the swizzle stick side. So your gear goes in there with the teeth facing up and the little hole side facing the car. So it's gonna go just like that. You see that? Now, before you stick it in there, you need to adjust all of your blinds to where they're perpendicular, so they're, they're fully open. With the teeth up and the flat side without the holes toward the back, I'm gonna feed it up in there. so and then put the clip piece back in now it operates just like the other ones you may have to adjust it like I explained earlier so I just adjusted it back a little bit now it should be right and you can hang your slat back on there Make sure the curvature of your slats is all the same direction. And it should function just like the others. Before I fix our last issue, I'd like to say that we're gonna put a link down below in the description where you can purchase any of the parts that you need for these, the little gears that go in them. And then uh, we'll also put a link down there if you just wanna replace the whole thing a uh, link for those and a link for new slats if you just need some new slats. Speaking of the new slats, one of the most common issues is one of your slats breaks. The little hole will break through the top like this. So you can see that there's, there's nothing there for it to clip onto uh, the gears up here. So if you just do want to temporarily fix this until you can get some new slats, what you'll need is a paper clip and a couple pieces of clear tape. You take the paper clip and you'll straighten it. In the paper clip like so and then you'll stick it on the slat and you want it right at the top of the where the hole would have been and then we're going to put a piece of clear tape here and on this side uh, and wrap it over the top to hold the paper clip on there okay got our paper clip in place and then we'll clip clip it back in there just like you would if it was a full blind. Okay. 
and then it's in there with the rest of them. Uh, it's not ideal because you might see the tape a little bit at the top, but uh, it'll get you by until you can order some new slats. Thanks for watching our video on how to repair your vertical blinds. Again, I'm Ross with Sky Management. Please like and subscribe.